For the first time in school history, a basketball team from Monaga is heading down to the state tournament. Clayton Castle visited the Braves tonight to talk about their historic season. In just two days, the Minnesota Girls Basketball State Tournament will see new faces when the Monaga Braves head down to participate in the school's first ever basketball state tournament. The head coach of the Braves credits the leadership of the team and its growth in the offseason. Tons of players on this team stepped up as leaders in this offseason and, and really took it upon themselves to be leaders. And, and that's the difference in us being 30 and 0 right now and, and in the state tournament and being maybe three, four, five uh, losses on the season. The players, on the other hand, credit the team chemistry for the success of the 30-0 season up to this point. We're really together. We like to communicate together. We're a close family. Most of us are all related. And it's a really good experience that we're going to state and can't wait for it. Among the leaders stands the only senior on the team in Leah Schwartz, who says it's been her dream to play in the state tournament. You live it up so much and everything. Seeing our fans when they turn off the lights and we all have the glow bracelets, it's honestly the coolest thing ever. I can't even, I can't even express myself on how awesome it is. In the four days since last week's section final win over Belgrade Brutonel Rosa, the city of less than 1,500 people has banded around and embraced the Braves. It feels amazing. Yeah, there's so much support from everyone. Everyone's just coming together and everyone loves the Braves and rowing boat. Standing in the way of the fifth seed of Braves at Williams Arena will be Miniota, who drew the fourth seed in the Class A tournament. Uh, Miniota's tough. They, uh, they play a lot like us. They got one, one tough post and uh, that'll, that'll give us some trouble down low because we lack size a little bit. But they, they got quick guards. They like to drive. They like to be aggressive. They like to run the floor. And so we'll have to um, play good team defense and uh, shoot the ball well. As for what it'll take to bring home that state title to Monaga, Leah Schwartz says the team just has to keep to the team motto, row the boats. They just got to keep rowing. Like, that's it. You just got to row and believe. Honestly, just believe. Reporting in Monaga, Clayton Castle, Lakeland News. Thanks, Clayton. 4-5 matchup. That's at the tip about 1 in the afternoon Thursday at the barn. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.